Today I'm going to show you how to cite a website in Noodle Tools. You can always get there by going to my website, www.burrowlibrary.org, and scrolling down to the Noodle Tools icon. Before I get to that, I want to talk about the differences between a web page and a website. The web page is where you find information, and the website is the home page. I always like to think about it like a book. A web page is like a page in a book, and the website is like a whole book. I am going to use this web page from history.com. I noticed that this website has a citation done for it already. Do not use it. It is almost always wrong. I want to also make sure the show title tag is active to help us cite it. It is an extension for Google Chrome, and mine is in the bottom right hand corner. You can add it to yours if you need to. Once I am in my project, I need to add a source. I need to go to the top left hand corner and click on New Source, which is highlighted in green. Then I will click on Website and then Web Page. I always want to start with the easiest part at the top. I focus on getting the URL, also known as the address, and then the dates. Date of access is today's date, and date of publication is the copyright date, usually at the bottom of the page. Next section is the web page part. We want to find an author. This is usually at the top or the bottom of the screen. I can't seem to find it, so I will leave this part blank. The second part of the web page citation is the web page or document slash article title. This is where we will use the show title tag. I will double click on it to select it and then copy it. I will then paste it into the box on the Noodle Tool screen. Now we will go to the next section. I will now look at the website section. We will need to go to the home page. I can click on the H icon on this to go back to www.history.com. I will use the show title tag to get the title of the website and paste it into Noodle Tools. Finally, we need to get the publisher of the website. This is usually at the bottom of the page. When I scroll down, I find that the publisher is right after the copyright symbol and is A&E Television Networks. I paste that into Noodle Tools. I have filled in all the information that I can find, so I can now hit save at the top of the screen. This will now take me to my sources page and is saved.